I'm Hilary Sharp and I'm a volunteer with the Musical Wellbeing Group and um, I really fell upon it by accident through Jane, um, one of the movers and shakers of the group, asked me whether I'd come along and help mainly with teas and coffees and chat, which actually I find that's what I'm good at, teas, coffees and chat. I, I really like the chat with this lovely, delightful group of elderly people, although not that much older than me, a couple, couple of decades possibly. Lovely, diverse group who didn't really know each other beforehand, and but they're all highly entertaining, sometimes without realising it. They love talking about their life stories, and they've all got such interesting life stories, as you can imagine, at that age. And we also have a laugh. Uh, and when I've finished a session, I literally go home with a spring in my step because there's always been something amusing or memorable or cheeky or, um, I don't know, entertaining. And also we learn such a lot about particularly their early lives. Um, I mean, there was one session that we did um, around about Remembrance Sunday when they talked about probably not their experiences of, of the Second World War, but their parents' experiences or other members of the family. And and then they reenacted little scenes of... Um, there was one member whose brother got the military cross and we reenacted, or he reenacted, going to the palace receiving that military cross. I mean, it, it, and I'm, I'm sure they didn't think when they got out of bed that morning that they were going to be reenacting little scenes, but it just progresses the way, the way the group is structured, or it's not even structured in a way, it's, it just happens and everybody chips in and things just evolve and you end up in a really nice place at the end of it. I, I think that they're completely away from their home scenario, which may have tensions and stresses for obvious reasons, you know, day-to-day -day routines that are dull and boring for everybody and for them as well. And they're in a situation where no one is judging them. It, there's a lot of laughter, there's music, obviously, there's action, um, and they interact with each other delightfully. Obviously, you know, as, as the group progresses, they do get to know each other but sometimes they don't remember <laughs> if, if they've met before and, and that's also part of the charm when they reintroduce themselves and you know you get little repetition bits and then you know what's coming and actually it's quite funny. <laughs> um, and the, I haven't heard any complaints, any moans uh, or anything. They've all got smiles on their faces as well. Um, but all the helpers, I think, enjoy it just as much as I do. I think we, we all get something out of it. It's not, it's not a one-way thing at all. It's definitely reciprocated. Well, I had a mother that um, suffered mild dementia, and I, I kind of think, well, she's no longer here, <laughs> but I can be with other people with, with dementia and imagine that it would have been lovely for her.